Hello everyone and welcome to module 10. Module 10 is going to have two major parts. First, we're going to set up our um, Yelp clone, as I like to call it. The Basically the final project that we're going to be working on for the entire rest of this course. We're going to be kind of building it up and, and adding features and squashing bugs and all kinds of stuff throughout the rest of the course. And the second topic we're going to cover is databases, specifically MongoDB. We're going to get a, a database set up and start using that for data persistence. So I called this final project Yelp clone. So let's just make sure really quick that everybody's familiar with Yelp. Basically, Yelp is a um, website that allows you to search for and review restaurants. Now, it's, it's got a lot of other things added now. Obviously, you can see burgers, barbers, spas, handyman, whatever they've, they've expanded. But at its core, Yelp used to be just about restaurants. That's really what the most people use it for now. So let's just find um, stuff near Hartsville. Let's see. Let's find restaurants. And it'll load up, and it gives us information about all these different restaurants. Um, so we've got here, um, you've got just the Midnight Rooster, Black Creek Feasters, Sam Kendall's Hook and All these, by the way, are fantastic. Um, I mean, all of them, and they're all very good. So this is kind of what we're going to be building. Ours is not going to be nearly as fleshed out as this. It's not going to be as polished, but it's going to be the basic idea. Yelp focused on restaurants, and they made a website where you can search through a bunch of restaurants, and anybody can review those restaurants and add comments and thoughts. There's an image for each restaurant, they've got the name, they've got ratings, they've got how much it costs, and some information about it. We're going to do the same thing. You're going to pick a topic of your choice, whatever whatever you want, and you're going to build a Yelp clone for it. It can, Your topic could be books, or pictures, or disc golf courses, or classes that you've taken at Coker, or video games, or anything else you want. I am going to do one on comic books, because I'm the nerd king of nerds, and I enjoy reading comic books. But you can do it on anything you want. To give you another example of what this might look like, we could go to... I've shown you this before, but it's the same thing. We've got different recipes. This one's focused on recipes instead of restaurants, but you can see that there's all these different recipes kind of arranged in an index page. Mine is three across, and then it's just tiled down. Oops, my picture broke. But it's... Um, and Yelp's is arranged differently. They've got one, and they've got this nice map over here, and they've got, like I said, all these advanced features, but we're not worried about that. We're going to build something much more similar to this based around the topic of your choice. As I said, this is restaurants, this is recipes, mine's going to be on comic books, you pick whatever the heck you want. As long as it's something that you can take a picture of, or have pictures of, that has a description, that um, people can would kind of like review or, or comment on, things like that, you're fine. Anything you want. Make it something that you're interested in. And that's it for this video. As always, if you have any questions, please let me know. I'll be happy to help. Thanks.